Indian equities witnessed extreme volatility last week, swinging between sharp losses and gains as US Fed Chair Jerome Powell reignited fears of higher interest rates. After noting the beginning of the disinflationary process last month, Powell switched gears in his recent testimony and said that rates could go higher than previously anticipated. All eyes are now on the US Fed rate decision on March 22, which will set the tone for the market trajectory. Meanwhile, market experts foresee domestic equities to remain volatile in the near term. In this upcoming FMC meet in the month of March, we expect Fed to increase interest rate by 50 bps. Not only that, we believe Fed will not stop here and will eventually increase rates by another 25 to 50 bps in the ensuing FMC meets. The current interest rate, which is around 4.5 to 4.75 percent range, will eventually settle around 5.5 to 5.75 percent range over the next two to three months. The reason for this stance is basically very high stubborn level of inflation. Last month, US CPI inflation reported a number of 6.4%, which was much higher than the estimate number of 6.2. Not only that, various macroeconomic indicators, whether it is labor market, trade data, consumer spending, manufacturing, have not shown any significant decline. So overall, we expect markets to remain volatile in the coming two to four months. We have instances where Fed will decide on their interest rate trajectory given how the inflation data will pan out. RBI most likely will increase rates to support currency as well as you know uh, uh, fight st- stubborn inflation over growth. And on, on the side, we have also seen some moderation in growth, which will remain under pressure as long as the interest rate remains high. We believe all this will put pressure on the markets and markets are remain to expect to remain sidelines for the next two to four months. This week, the February CPI inflation print in India and the US also remains crucial. According to a poll by Reuters, the February retail inflation is expected to slightly ease to 6.35% from 6.52% in January. This will still be above the RBI's upper threshold of 6% for a second straight month. Against this, technical charts suggest range-bound trade for the benchmark indices. The Nifty 50 is yet again seen testing support at its 200 DDMA at 17,400 odd levels. Moreover, the 17,350 level is a key level to watch out for as it coincides with the 50 week moving average and a 20 month moving average. As long as the index holds about 17,350, a quick revival in sentiment cannot be ruled out. However, in case 17,350 is broken on a sustained basis, the index could slide another 1000 points to 16,300 levels. In the interim, the index may seek support around 17,030 odd level. The bias for Bank Nifty is likely to remain negative below 40,900. The banking index could test 39,500 on the downside. This week, the Sensex may swing in the range of 58,100 to 60,100, with support likely around 58,750 and 58,300. That said, equity markets will track their global peers today following last Friday's jobs data released in the US. If you like this video, share it and subscribe to Business Standard. For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com. Do also follow us on YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Telegram and LinkedIn.